Squares and square roots, practice number three. One, determine the value of each square root. What is the square root of 0.36? The last digit, which is the six, is in the hundreds column, therefore the fraction will be out of 100. The 36 will be your numerator. The square root of 36 is six, and the square root of 100 is 10, so the answer is six over 10. What is the square root of 0.81? The last digit, which is a 1, is in the hundreds column, therefore it's out of 100. The 81 will be your numerator. The square root of 81 is 9, and the square root of 100 is 10. So the answer is 9 over 10. What is the square root of 0.49? The last digit, which is a 9, is in the hundreds column, therefore it's out of 100. The 49 will be your numerator. The square root of 49 is 7, and the square root of 100 is 10. So the answer is 7 over 10. And what is the square root of 0.16? The last digit, which is a 6, is in the hundreds column. Therefore, it's out of 100. The numerator will be 16. The square root of 16 is 4. And the square root of 100 is 10. So the answer is 4 over 10. Two, calculate the area of the square when given the square root. Use the diagram to help you solve. One side of the square will have a value of one out of one, two, three units. So one third units. That's the square root. The area is gonna be side squared. So it's gonna be one third squared. And this will have a value of one out of nine units. So the area is equal to one over nine square units. B. One side will have a value of one, two, three, four, five, six out of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven units. So one side has a value of six over seven units. This would be your square root. So to find the area, you'll square that, which is going to be six, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, out of seven, 14, 21, 28, 35, 42, 49. So 36 out of 49 square units.